people usually use test strip to measure the concentration of the sodium hypochlorite after they prepare the solutions. Today, I'm going to show you this pen can do a better job for you. So this is pure water. It's here. And uh, I take the test strip in this water. And uh, because this is pure water, so this is white color. So it's nothing in the water. The same thing. This pen here is zero, zero, zero. It's nothing in the water. So I started to take the sodium hypochlorite. This is about 12% um, concentration. So I add it in this pure water. And I uh, agitate it a little bit. So this solution I prepare. How much is it? I take this test strip and then dig to the water. This is the color I have. So to compare the colors here, it should be around 50. By now, I uh, take this meter, this pan, in the water. And so it's the concentration of this solution is 48. Compared with the test strip, yeah, here, yeah, it's uh, less than 50. Oh, second, if you want to uh, prepare a solution for uh, 200 part per minute ppm, I also tell you, use this pen and add the sodium hypochlorite together and then you will see the concentration is become higher and higher. It's 60 now, 185. Four hundred oh five. That's the number I want. I want to prepare a solution for two hundred around minus plus two percent. Now it's two hundred and three. So I compare with the test strips here. That is the color for 200, exactly. So you can see this pen can exactly tell you the number, what's, uh, what was the percentage of the sodium hypochlorite. But not all the people uh, use pure water to prepare the solutions. 99% prepare the sodium hypochlorite solution is by tap water. So tap water is of, uh, including a lot of uh, minimal, mineral material in organic compounds I need. So this water is have a, an uh, offset, we call. This offset is the lumber in the water. For this tap water is uh, 22. This 22 is already in the water. It will interfere the reading. So when we use this tap water to prepare the solution, we need to subtract the number of this 22. Let's say uh, we want to prepare a solution for 500 ppm. So we should prepare the 522 of this meter number. I'll show you.
So the same. So I Okay, so we use the test strips here. Okay, you see the colors here. Yeah, it's in uh, 500 levels. So you see, uh, today we show you that this pen can replace your test strip, and uh, you can have exactly the lumber, and instantly and durable products, and it can use uh, one battery, can use more than uh, two years, or twenty thousand times measurement, and you don't use uh, throw away anything, and save your money. Thank you.